Samsung Electronics has posted profits that uh, beat market expectations after a dip in earnings for six consecutive quarters. Slumping smartphone sales even led the Korean tech giant to free salaries this year. But according to our Song Ji-san, the latest earnings report seems to shine a light at the end of the tunnel. Samsung Electronics' first quarter figures show the Korean tech giant did better in terms of quality than it did in quantity. Samsung generally fared better than expectations despite seasonal factors and slowing demand in the global market. Samsung's sale for the first three months of the year stood at 43 billion U.S. dollars, down 11 percent from last year. Profits were also down 30 percent during the same period, standing at 5.4 billion dollars. While sales fell slightly short of market expectations, profits actually outstripped the market consensus continuing its recovery, gaining 12 percent from the fourth quarter of last year. The smartphone maker's profitability also bounced back to double figures, settling at over 12.5 percent. While the guidance figure released on Tuesday does not break down performance by sector, market analysts assume Samsung generated $3 billion in profits from its semiconductor arm and $2 billion from its mobile sector. Actually, Q1 you know, results uh, was, was quite impressive because the uh, market consensus was you know, 5.4 trillion won, but uh, their you know, OP was, OP results was you know, 5.9 trillion won. Because of the uh, Samsung Semi division, even though the, uh, uh, it's a slow you know, seasonality in Q1, they could uh, reduce the cost uh, so they could make the high OP in Q1 this year. With some analysts calling Samsung's first quarter figures an earnings surprise, their expectations that the second quarter profits could top 7 billion U.S. dollars, with its latest Galaxy S6 smartphone model set to go on global release on Friday. Song Ji-sun, Arirang News.